Do what? we know which game yet? My roommate's also doing Evo for a game. I think it's like some Shonen Jump kind of anime. Huh. So, so an arena fighter. Okay. So now we have Fawn versus John Numbers. Ike versus not not we fit trainer the pendant in in training me brawler running the one two one two set i like that the me brawler is just john himself he, he does that on all the me's or, or, he does that on all his me's on all the setups that have a stream on them you know what to be fair i do have one friend that i play with all the time and he always like goes through his me that looks like him like, with the dumbest costume he's like you know what I don't trust anybody to beat you but me. I mean, I'll do I, it myself. I mean, I've done that. I, I had a, uh, I had like a brawler in Smash 4 for a bit. Brawler's a really good character. Right? Smash like 4 3DS really... to be specific. Oh man, I remember buying that two months just to like play early. I that... mean, I, I still play the game because I just never owned a Wii U. You never owned a Wii U? Nope. And it was a, it was the right decision, frankly. Man, the Wii had so many great games. Just like this is a great game right the here. The Wii had great games. The Wii U had Splatoon. The Wii U had phenomenal games. I think it's definitely the Dreamcast of our era. The Wii U had great games like to uh, Toad Treasure Hunter, Zombie U, um, Devil Stir. Zombie Third, U. Just for the I'm memes. I'm not sure if you're being serious. You're being like, no, no, but with Zombie U. <laughs> No, I okay. I really, really like Zombie U. Oh my god, and that's got a very special place in my heart. I'm, I'm super biased a little. Well, whatever, whatever you say. I liked it. I mean, I like I like Secret Rings more than most, but I'm also a Sonic fan. I can't say the same about franchise attachment to Zombie U. <laughs> franchise, by the way. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, all right. Here we go. What are we gonna see here? So do we know what um, what move John has here? Uh, he, when we were fighting earlier, he went one two one two. Okay. It sounds like a I, combination I, for a save. Yeah, yeah, can I go? Yeah. There we go. He's literally running the uh, alpha move here, so. Okay. So he has a flip kick down B. He has thruple punch. He has the, uh, the suplex. He has suplex and uh, whatever that mock punch I believe. Flashing mock punch. Oh, yeah. fantastic. So actually, no, I think it's 2 to 1 too, because one, one neutral B, I believe, is shot put. Yes. Okay. Good little flash kick there. All right, now it does look like John is struggling to actually get into Fawn. I mean, this is also just Ike. Yeah. I hate that that's a true combo, by the way. Why does down throw Thrupper work for so long? Look, we need to entice people to oh. play a brawler in some way. I don't want uh, Apple Reviewer at ETN yeah. just completely stealing stocks <laughs> off of, like, tech chases. Oh my god. That was so funny to watch. <laughs> oh, and I was just watching and I was like, bro, this, guy, this guy's getting so much mileage out of just one or two really good reads. It's kind of amazing. Hey, if it works. I mean, that's just the name of the game with this character. Yeah, hey, don't, don't get red. Don't mess. John really missing their deep breathing, their sun salutation, but they're making it work here as they're trying to take the second stock and prove that Brawler has the sauce. That was, he went to Fort Smash to catch like the Ragnar startup of Aether off stage. That wasn't even a bad idea, it just mistimed it. Yeah. No, if John puts a little more work into this character in the lab, I think they could be a monster. He already has a sword fighter. I'm surprised they just didn't go the sword fighter. My goodness. Swordfighter is also not good. I think Swordfighter is better than you think. There are 86 plus characters, 80 of them are viable. Swordfighter is not one of them. Viable until. Uh, non viable until they start getting results. Listen, Tornado tornado to Uppy is no longer what was cracked up to be. Oh no, you don't use Tornado now, it's Chakra now. Chakra Ring. Chakra and Tornado are not the same. Probably. No, they're definitely not. I mean, Chakra is side B. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, Not bad. Ooh, good, uh, good catch. Oh, oh my god! Yeah! And John takes the first game. <laughs> just, just like, like you why? It's like, you son of a bitch, you actually did it. Like well, let's get that one more time. Looks like, oh, I'm gonna double, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna double jump off stage. Watch, watch, watch. Uh, John is being like, here! Yeah. Double jump, like, get the. Get back down there! Look at these, look at these kicks I have right now. Say hello to Bayonetta for me. Is that just because Numbers was playing someone that wasn't weak fit? He wasn't gonna go for a spike. <laughs> 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 I saw a you fool. 
I saw a t-shirt at DTN that said, uh, if I miss the spike, I'm gonna kill myself. I should have bought that for John. Oh no, the sea loud? Sea loud. Which is me brawler. Quite John is really Quite the tier difference in stories, I will say. Yes. The fact that the overlay is covering the limit bar actually a lot of Oh no. It's okay, we can see it. I know we can see it, it just looks really bad. Because <laughs> it wasn't something that we... Uh... It's, it's not our fault UI is the way it is. Yeah, no, it yeah. really isn't. Like, I still feel like it's one of the cleanest designs. Whoa. It seriously is. For an overlay, but it's like... You get weird stuff like this when you have characters that have random, like, little uh, features. It's Smash's fault for not having the gauge, like, over percent. They put it over his portrait. Portrait looks better. It's more aligned with the Final Fantasy A little more rage, that would have done it, to be honest. Oh my god. Okay, you're done. No, John's wow. not dead. Believe. I forgot, Meat Brawler is actually deceptively heavy. I distinctly recall number asking me when we were streaming uh, ETN, why is Apple Reviewer not using shot put? And I'm like, did you see Mock Punch? And like, the way that you can just space it at mid-range and not get punished because of how dangerous it is. Yeah. And it has like no end lag. No, shot put is incredible. And now it's just like, oh wait, they're actually cooking. The shot put is incredible, but I'd rather have a cannon that I literally pull out every few seconds. Fair. I mean, shot put in this matchup, it's probably like better oh. on paper. You know what? Yeah, probably just because I get limits cloud for coverage. Right. Okay, here we go. Because it's Sea Loud Strike! Oh no! You know what? The little taste of his own medicine. No drop kick, boyo. You're going to die. I think died inside because they missed the punish there. Wow. There we go. He wanted, but he got the Alright, holding shield. Sorry, it's not the big. Down throw. Trying to mix it up. Go for some crossovers. Nice duplex. First time we've seen that in this set. Don't do that. Meatballer falls super fast. I thought he was just gone. Right? He still might be eating hearts. Alright, good DI out. Ooh. Man's actually went for it. Unfortunately, now you're in cloud country. Wow. I'm not, I'm not talking about the UK. I, I swear to God, I heard that in clown. Like, clown yeah, country? We are actually firmly in clown country right now. <laughs> okay. Both on last stock. John numbers are like in triple per digits already. One back there is going to just take them Whoa. out. Numbers going to scum out another kill. Yeah, can we? It's can me, Brawler. It's John. Put put both those things together and uh, magic can happen. Except now. Yep, can't do anything against that back here. Bond with a sigh of relief. It's like, gosh. As John looks at the camera, is like, you cost me the game. You took game one! Don't give me that shit. Can you see it again? Wanna I wanna see it again? again. Yeah! <laughs> Let's see that again. We didn't get the good reaction. We didn't right. get the good reaction. Boom. <laughs> so, <laughs> I honestly love that. <laughs> How good this happened to me? <laughs> Can we make Mario. that a new emote? In Snatch? <laughs> we have Diet Vivi at home. <laughs> Vivi at home, no! Numbers is playing Lucario back when Vivi was, uh, was a small child. You're not wrong. Alright. Who remembers the Brawl Lucario numbers? Who, who remembers the who remembers the Smash 4 Schultz VB? That's my question. Oh my god. Smash 4, Smash 4 Schultz numbers. My most vivid memory of Shulk in Smash 4 was I was at the Foundry and there was a guy who just went on stream, I think, winners round two. Just side bead off stage, first stock, zero percent, and just well, pretty much is like, my god, just unplug your controller dog. Yeah, bro, I knew this guy. Come on. You can always win. I know, I know. Until the game's over, you always <laughs> have a chance to win. No, he did really well, brought it to last dog, but man. Unfortunately, this is also Fawn Numbers is fighting, who has experience with one of the best, if not the best, Lucario in the US of A. Right, and Fawn does actually have a snake, being one of their um, 
I'd say one of their top five characters, like in the roster, in their back pocket. No, like, I, like I've talked to, I've talked to her, and she says like, Snake is one of her favorite characters to play, but it's such a mental stack. It really is. I mean, there's a hundred things that you have to keep track of: the Whoa. grenades, the C4, how you're going to recover the. Yep, the B reversal's up in the air. Pay no mind to the spirit bomb charging right now. Hey, John Ember is looking like a young BB out here. Only young because obviously the movement Whoa. isn't as fluid. They're not letting that rip. You're not seeing a lot of setups as BB would do. Oh, but you also wouldn't see Alrighty that from BB. Then. Extreme speed doing due diligence. You think this was a freaking wow? You interesting. You think that was Terra Dragon of just how much of a delete button that was? Thank you for the follow, uh, Fluffy Pomeroy. Aww, I like that name. God, this huh. song is so good. <laughs> right? Here we go. As John Evers, did John Evers try to double team that? That did 21 without the command grab. Goodness. My, my lord. John has been doing an excellent job of, like, just keeping track of where that C4 is. For any Wrong other play. way, buddy boy. Yep. Instant death. That starts killing instantly at, like, what, 160? Um, after, yes, so, down, down towards 160. Yes. Yeah, so it becomes true. It be actually gains, like, extra frames of it. I believe at 140, it still becomes true a lot. Wow. Nope. I mean, it, it was, was it isn't a cool idea. It isn't. This isn't the character to do that against. Yeah. All you're Unless doing they're is really low. All you're doing is refreshing Cipher. Or is still relatively low. Still a really even game so there, Snake being one of the heavier characters. If Funk and, like, she's out of kill right now, they'll be in a much better spot. Yeah, but John's just accumulating damage. This must be so frustrating. Just to set all these traps up and John just not going in, not falling for it. Thank Waiting you. for the precise moment. Thank you, Daisy, for the follow as well. Hi, you're Daisy. Evidently, yes. Great double team. It doesn't come out. That is that is something that that is something that uh, Lucario can do. Just take a grenade and then time your Wow. And time your double team accordingly. Yeah, because it does target the character, not the projectile, right? Yeah, it homes in on the character. Uh, it homes in on their height, but not like their uh, positioning. Ah. Because Lucario can actually choose which side he appears on. Cool. Yeah, you you hold you hold either left or right, and Lucario will come in swinging from that direction. Yep. Unlike Greninja, where you just hold a direction and Greninja just goes that way. 185 and 104. Oh, this is terrifying for both sides. Gonna keep it. Don't do it missed. again. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna die first. You're speaking into existence right now. Uh oh, oh, that's a little too yeah, low. No nope. way. Yeah, <laughs> not yeah. a 200. It was a great idea, though. If they could have like teched I'm, it on stage, they would have lived. I'm pretty sure that'd be it's unteckable. It's 100%. Dang. Like it's, At 200, that better be unteckable. Yeah, like it's, it's primarily vertical knockback, so even holding down with the back. Ah. Oh my God, please. John may clutch this out. <laughs> no, nope, nope, not with that up tilt. I mean, they John couldn't have like angled to ledge from that height. You just had to take your lumps there. Right. Hey, they did get a kill like that. Rare moment of John actually misremembering where that C4 is. Nice, right, John just tosses it back. He's just tossing spirit aura after aura after aura. Five and a half minutes. Back throw. Oh, oh my gosh, gosh that would have been it. missed. Okay, what are we gonna see here? What kind of setup? These grenades is are Is that the online. lifeline that Fawn needs? That is the question. Oh my gosh, that's C4. What a cool. Oh! <laughs> that would have done it. There. That actually would have just done it. Yeah. That would have done it too. I think Fawn is really just relying on numbers trying to jump in to try to get the upstairs. 
Max right. rage up till we'll probably start killing at least at 100. Right, C4 is not here. That no. might be. That's not it, but this is a great position for John to do something. Where's the C4? Could time out. It's on the right platform. Okay. Should time out. Why? Yeah, why it's, it's why right should there. he time out? Because it's 30 seconds. There's no reason. Oh, no way. Oh! oh you dummy! Alright, we're going to game three. Oh! Bumpers, why would you jump in? Oh, Excuse me, God. I'm going to yell at him. <laughs> Get off. Can, can, we, can we see like the walkthrough? I feel like numbers of is the waiting venue? for it. I feel like numbers <laughs> is waiting for it. Why did you land on top of Snake? You know better than that. Come on, bro. You know better than that. Oh, hell yeah. What has such a shitty to get out of face now, too? That's so, it was such a good match. Okay, alright. Come on! Well, we got a bracket reset, folks. True Grand Finals is right here, right now. With a, less, with a much less interesting <laughs> matchup. Wasting my time. Wasting your time. I need, I, say, I need to go home so I can go take a flight to Toronto tomorrow. Oh, you're actually flying out. Yeah, I'm going tomorrow. Oh, dang. Okay. Well, thank you for being here and running production. Someone had to. I thought, I thought he was staying home. Number said he was, I don't know. <laughs> oh no. It's Bayonetta. Okay, okay. I'm so I'm surprised he didn't punish that hard landing there. Oh, nice. Really want to spike. Okay, some good follow-ups there. John Number's almost dead. Pawn just needs one good back air. Or edge guard. Never guaranteed against John. If that hit the other way, Fawn actually just straight out. Or that'll do it too. Ah, double knees will do it. Ooh. Honestly, a Bayonetta classic. Come out state, <laughs> come out platform, just forward smash. I'm getting I'm getting this giant fist one way or another. You gotta at least get one, then you win the viewers' hearts. What do we see here? Nice neutral get up. Using the invincibility to avoid getting spiked by the ball. One, two, a three! Not high enough. Wow, one thing I have noticed in this entire bracket. Bond does not like using enough. Oh, there we go, never mind. I was gonna like, where's which time? Well, really. Hold on. Okay, I wasn't sure if that was gonna be original or not. So. Numbers doesn't really put himself in a position often where, you know, which time would actually slump the okay. Why'd you jump into Weefit Trainer? Damn, really real the opposite of, of what just happened. Truly. I see no difference between this and Snake Up Tilt. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> in fact, if anything, it's, it, the parallels are stunning. You see, like... It's, it's honestly exhibit, worse, because... Because oh, WeFit is, you know, invincible. Exhibit, exhibit A. Jeez. Like Cue my walkout. Exhibit B. <laughs> Could've gone home. Exhibit B. Dink. Exactly the same thing. Fair, fair. Alright, we're back at it again, though. Bon hoping to get one on the board and continue their loser's run. It's a victory, of course. Having just reset the brackets. As one is wont to do when you fall into obvious moves that you really shouldn't. Okay, nice little stall there on ledge. Did Bayonetta just like emit a sigh of some sort when teetering at ledge there? Did uh, I, did no, I... it, was, it was a whoa. It's whoa. She definitely made some sound. Yeah. Like, oh, whoa. It just sounds like a moan because it's British. Sure, that, that's why. Oh, it was the right call. And that's call, why we don't lose time that often. Fair, fair. I get caught by it all the time because I'm Sonic the Hedgehog. I have to spin at you to get my damage, unfortunately. Like, what other moves? Oh, no. I would have lashed that hit. Oh, my gosh. I was praying it would. 
Would have been fun. There we go. Leo can't crouch under this one. It's honestly a surprisingly really good move against John Luther here. I mean, it's also just gigantic. Yes. Okay, John with just a run and grab. Soccer ball's back on board. Oh god, one after another. Alright. What are we gonna get started here? Following John off stage, uh -oh. but John falling right back. Almost wow. getting, almost getting the dare there. Thanks, Brave247. Yeah, Brown's gonna have to be braver here if they're gonna clutch out the second stock from John. This is their tournament life now. One more stock, one more stock. Playing a dangerous game here. Oh my gosh. Not again. Alright, John, looking to close it out real quick. Buffon with a good mix up there. Crossing up with the neutral air. Honestly, though, good on numbers for like. Staying, like, keep continuing to run, recognizing his witch time, because a lot of lesser players, myself included, they see, like, a change in the ki in the opponent, and be like, oh, okay, time to press a button of some sort. Right. Oh, no. Missing the deep breathing. Unfortunately, forward smash just too laggy. Oh. Oh. You know what it is? Hmm. Helper, I think there's an audio issue on the the right side of the stage. That's well, what's I going on. I considered that, but I looked. I'm mean, looking at the balancing for the, for the audio. And yeah. It's definitely like it definitely has left right stereo. So it's still. Strange. No, it's a, yeah. It's not a production thing. It's the game's being weird. Yeah. No, it's just like that happened only on the right side. Yeah, I noticed. Okay. I did notice that earlier. I wanted to actually check the switch and see if maybe someone balanced it so it's primarily on the left. Okay. Because uh, I, I believe that is possible in the game, but whatever. It don't matter none. Oh what do I man. Do? <laughs> well, that was a great workout. And Fun having immediate words to say. Look, look at how fast she gets up out of her chair. Right? That was like frame one. All right. If, if we so see you see here. a kill screen. Bink. Yeah. What are you doing, you son of a gun? Oh, you dirty <laughs> son of a gun. You <laughs> How many games? How many games have we played together and you've done this to me? What? I feel that. I feel that. <laughs> we yeah. all feel it. It's New York. Getting, getting bought by numbers is just the rite of passage. Okay, so I don't think we actually have any uh, credits for this week, so I want to just thank everybody for tuning right, in. Aww. Numbers literally walked in here, called me an asshole. What an antisocial individual. I can't believe that he's our Man Zeno, took his money just like, all right, everyone, get the hell out of my venue. I'm going to go home and count my cash. My money. I'm my money take... from yesterday looks very nice with my money from today. Well, at least Two let's give a shout out to envelopes. the. Hello, John Numbers. Why did you attend Zeno today? I like money. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Numbers. That's also, good. love for the I game. Do you, wanna, you guys want to interview the champion of, of Zeno? Yeah, come two? on. Okay, cool. John, get over here. What? And delay our proceedings? Oh, no, I'm going to give him a take off the headset. All right, bye, guys. Bye. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, I'm sorry. How do you feel,